Hello everyone. So in my previous video, we have already talked about dynamic popular dropdown based on data source. So in this video, I'm gonna to tell uh, I'm gonna tell how to do dynamic population dropdown uh, using generic lists. So uh, to to do that, let's go to misc admin first and generic lists. Let let's create a new page. Maybe country list let's add a nice name here maybe country list create now let me add this particular component here let's add two component add a nice name here and a value here india here i will add one more like china maybe So now it's pretty simple. Now uh, this is my component. Let me delete it first and do it again in front of you. So this is my uh, select uh, uh, widget and in the data source node. So here I need to add two properties. Sling colon resource type will be this. Mm, I already mentioned in my blog what is the sling resource type it will be always same now the other value which will change is path so path will be the path of the page it will no, don't add dot html so this so if you open uh, the component on a page can see that the values you are showing as drop down if one day you want to add one more one more country here maybe Malaysia what will happen the new value will get added here so if you already know what uh, I mean the values are pretty static and you want author to add values so you can use this ACS common features. I hope you like the video. Thanks for watching.